<laughs> what did you forget? What did you forget? I, I didn't forget. I didn't forget. <laughs> I didn't forget. Didn't forget what? What did you forget? Nothing. Okay. What didn't you forget? Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. So how could you forget it if you didn't forget it? And if you don't know what you forgot and you didn't forget it, then you would know what you did not forget. So what did you nothing, not forget? Nothing, nothing. Nothing, <laughs> nothing. Nothing, nothing. Uh, cheers. Got my coffee. <laughs> Such a tiny little cup, too. I need a bigger cup. All right, Minnie Mouse. Are you ready for a test today? Okay. Uh huh. Oh, we're doing test t -ta -t -ta -t -ta -t 12, right? Not 19. What am I doing? I got the wrong test. <laughs> Hold on. That's the one we want. That's the one we want. Yes, 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 yes. I read, and I read uh, sounds. Uh, answer a paper because I will forget. You forgot again. <laughs> you will forget what? I forget the uh, answer. You forgot the answers. You wrote the answers down. You did actually. You actually prepared for your test. Yes. <laughs> so you have your test papers. I prepare the this test for two hours. Oh my God, two hours. Wow. That's good. I'm like looking forward to all these wonderful answers then. <laughs> all right. Well, that's good. So let's start then. Our interest 12 speaking test, CEFRA2. So I'm going to ask you about two topics that we had in our lessons. We did one about amazing animals and we did one about street food. So I'll ask questions about those two lessons. And then of course, the reading comprehension will be about the strange stories, the fence tiger and the Yeti, hmm. Yeti. the Yeti, the abominable snowman. <laughs> All right. So. Topic one, animals. The first question is, do you like animals? Yes. Why or why not? Yes. So yes, why do you like animals? I, because uh, it's so cute. Cute. <laughs> cute. So a shark some, is cute? Some people, no. <laughs> the shark is a dangerous animal. I don't like it. You don't like the dangerous animals. But the other ones are cute. Yeah. Which ones are cute? Dogs. Dogs? Um, Dogs are cute. Panda. Pandas? <laughs> yes. Uh-huh. What about Brian's? No. The Brian's, Brian's cute? No. <laughs> the Brian's aren't cute? Oh, okay. What about chickens? Maybe <laughs> alligators. Maybe alligators are cute. No. <laughs> <laughs> of all the animals, because we talked about lots of them, what animals do you think are the most amazing and why? Dog. Dogs. Okay. You why? can see the dog can become the dog. Police? Police dog, yes. Helps the fly people crossing the street. C and I dogs, yes, the golden retrievers. That's right. They were they they very smart. They can understand our thinking. To a point, yeah. We did a live stream on dog's best friend. A couple of years ago yeah. and in that in that live stream we talked about how intelligent a dog could get and the average dog could be as smart as a two and a half year old or something i forget how old a child 
So it could, I think it was like learn up to two or 300 words, like vocabulary that it would recognize. And there was a border collie, which is supposed to be one of the smartest dogs. And that dog, it was a record, I think, he could remember a thousand words. That's a lot of vocabulary for a dog. <laughs> he knew the names of like a thousand toys or something like that. It is amazing. Dogs are amazing. They're great family pets. They're smart. They're loyal. Uh, they have good security for the family as well. Um, yeah, absolutely. What other animals are amazing? What? What other animals are amazing? Dangerous. Amazing. No. <laughs> Do you know another one that's amazing? Can you amazing? think of another one? Yeah. Uh, cat. Cats. They don't do anything. They just sleep and eat. <laughs> Dying cat. <laughs> they're easy to take care of, but they're not too smart. <laughs> uh, rabbit. Uh, fish. Uh, <laughs> buffalo. It's going to train your fish. <laughs> Big. <laughs> Well, some of the mammals are very smart. The dolphins and the, the orca whales, they're very, very smart. That's for sure. But um, what are the elephants are, have have pretty good intelligence too. Um, uh, the bird is smart. Uh, the Thai bird talk too much. What? I don't, I forgot the name. Parrot? Yes. Uh, one. Yeah. <laughs> We don't want a cracker. <laughs> You're going to repeat people. <laughs> Surprisingly, yeah. Um, they say that crows are really intelligent. The crow, the blackbird. Uh -huh. Yeah, because I was a guy saved a, uh, a, a, a baby crow, whatever that would be called. I'm not sure what you'd call a baby crow. But um it was very smart. It, it it didn't leave. It stayed at his house. And it would actually, like, he would actually take a comb and comb the, the crow. And then if he put the comb on the table, the crow would go over and pick up the comb and come back and give it to him because he wanted more <laughs> more combing. Um, there's that one. And there was another story about the crows where apparently they they don't forget you. Um, somebody did something mean to the crow and every time he would come home or walk down that street the crow kept attacking him all the time always remembered him and they always kept coming and attacking him so crows are supposed to be pretty intelligent too there is a lot of them yeah supposedly well imagine if you're combing you know pet combing the crow and then he put the the comb down and then a crow goes over and picks it up and comes and gives it back to you <laughs> that would be pretty cool <laughs> yeah dogs are definitely up there for sure because i don't think we'll have too many dolphins for pets which animal do you think is the most dangerous to humans lots of uh crocodile uh baby shark a baby shark <laughs> maybe shark or baby shark Shark. A <laughs> shark. <laughs> Definitely. Uh, rhino. Yeah, they smash your car. Mosquito. Mosquito? Yeah, it's still considered an animal, even though it's an insect, right? Every every living creature is an animal, I think. Sanction. Yeah, I guess it is. It's part of the animal kingdom. Mosquitoes are the worst. They kill more people every year than any other thing on earth. They kill like a million people a year, like especially in Africa with the malaria, the disease that they carry. And usually young kids or senior citizens, not usually the strong and healthy, but the, the weaker, the old and the young that they kill a lot of people. I don't remember what the number two animal killer in the world was i think it was like snakes or something like that 
venomous snakes. Snake. Yeah, but yeah. crocodiles, they're definitely dangerous. They'll hunt you for sure if you're in the water or near the water. Hippos are really dangerous too. Hippos are very aggressive and territorial. They'll attack boats and they're very dangerous. I think almost all animals are dangerous at one one point or not because they're animals, you know, so they can be dangerous. Dogs can bite you. Cats can claw you. Yeah. <laughs> Dogs. Most dangerous. Yeah, a lot of the a lot of the animals in Africa for sure. Bears. <laughs> I wouldn't want to meet a polar bear. No, thank you. I'll pass on that. <laughs> Beer. Bears. Yeah, they're they're really dangerous too. Usually they run away when they hear you or they smell you. But um sometimes they don't. <laughs> and that's a problem. In the water for sure. There's lots of dangerous animals in the water. Yeah. All right. Let's go to topic two. Street food. Finish topic one.